it's quite amazing seeing big juggernaut looking ass niggas, you know? Niggas that wake up, go to the gym, come home from work, go to the gym. Oh, I only got a... Uh, I only got one day off of work this week? Spends the whole day at the gym? You see, we might sleep talk. We might sleep talk. Them niggas be sleep bench pressing. <laughs> they be like, they be like, <laughs> It evokes both a positive and negative emotion seeing niggas like that, you know? Uh, positive being damn. That guy puts in a lot of time and energy into sculpting his body. That's cool as hell. And then there's the damn. That nigga could probably rip my head off with just 14% of his power. Like, do you see yourself? Not for real, like, do you see yourself? Because I admit, I'm jealous. I want some of that muscle. I'm, I'm trying to look like Jonathan Joestar in this bitch. <laughs> me, meanwhile, a nigga over here built like this nigga. I don't even remember his name. Some Italian bullshit. Do you, like, do you see how you look? Do you see how you look? I'm not hanging around you. You look like you fight warruses, buddy. You look like you eat cinder blocks for a light snack. What's, what's that one meme again? That one meme? A guy that looks like this smacks your girl's ass. What you doing? And the punchline was, oh, oh that's his girl now. <laughs> that's his girl now. Damn right. Better suck that nigga's dick right now before he kills both of us. <laughs> Matter of fact, you're taking too long. He getting angry. Let me show you how it's done. Big buff dudes are actually more often than not really nice people, but uh, let's say, for instance, I get into a physical altercation with one of these nice people. I am not fighting fair. Anything I can find, rock, paper, scissors, a gun, all those hours of training, all those hours of training just to be shot in the gut by a scrawny ass nigga that probably only weighs one sixteenth the weight of your fucking gorilla arms. What a shame. What a shame. Self-control on my own and lonely niggas to load when the money go missing. Yeah. And my wallet and my ribcage, I love love enough for comfort knowing money to go with it.